What's going on, guys? Let me calm down a little bit. I got the I got the sleeves rolled up. I got the pants rolled up above my calves. This is what this team do to me. This team always, you know, gotta stress me out. They gotta bring the 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 blood pressure up so high for me. Why do they do this to me? I don't know. I didn't do nothing to them. We didn't do nothing to them. But at the end of the day, they got the W, and that's all that mattered. Now, Bradley Bill, a report came out that his agent denied saying he wanted to get out of Washington pronto. And he played 50 minutes tonight. He just previously played like 40 plus minutes. I want to get out of here too if I was him. But serious, on a serious note, great game from the backcourt with John and Brad. The first half and the second half, it was kind of a tell of two stories, maybe I should say. First half, in this first quarter especially, the Rockets was like started off six for six from three. Gordon got hot early, and he kind of stayed hot throughout the game. Um, he was killing it. Harden, as usual, was killing it. He scored 50-plus points. A lot, of a lot of stars score 50-plus points against the Wizards because they're just not a good defensive team. But when they needed to, they locked in. Bill did a great job late game against Harden, against that vicious step back. He keyed in. He locked in. John locked in, too. Made some clutch shots late in the game. Uh, Markeith Morris off the bench once again. Double-double. I think he had 20-plus points. 22, maybe, and 10 rebounds. Good game off the bench once again. Seems like he he's liking that role of five off the bench. And that's where he should stay. Coming, coming off the bench as the five. Um, Otto Porter. You got to get your, your clutch rating up, man. You got to. You missed a wild open three, then you missed the field goal. I mean, a free throw. That could have cost the Wizards. But in overtime, he had some key defensive stops. He had some turnovers, forced some turnovers, and that's good. So he kind of made up for it. This game was crazy. It was fun. If you missed it, I suggest you go watch it. First half, it 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 kind of was, it was, became back and forth in the second quarter. The first quarter, all Rockets. All Rockets. Second quarter, which just kind of fought back, but the Rockets were still doing their thing. Third quarter, second half, it was still back and forth, really, honestly. Uh, they had some mini runs here and there. James Harden had a four-point play. It was a crazy game, man. But fourth quarter came. Um, I think it was the fourth or third quarter. Harden just got hot. He was just cashing. Every time, come up to court, step back three, cash. Cash, four-point four, four play. It was crazy, man. It kind of makes you think, what if Harden was traded to the Wizards for Bill? You know, it makes you think that. But that's besides the point. Very exciting game. Wizards get the W. On to the Pelicans next. They keyed in on defense when they needed to, and they made shots. Now, these free throws still need some work. They really do. I'm sweating. But at the end of the day, I'm proud of the Wizards. You know, even though the Rockets was missing Chris Paul, they still could have easily lost control of this game after the first quarter. Easily. We know everybody in the NBA knows how the Wizards could have been struggling. They could have gave up. In that first quarter, and it could have been a blowout, but it wasn't. They fought, they took control in overtime, and they finished it off. And also, had some decent bench play. Morris, Green, um, Sadoransky, and Rivers had some nice plays here and there. Thomas Bryant, I give a shout-out to him because I like him. All overall, it was a good team win. It was a good team win. Both backcourts from both both me from both teams shine. And like I said before, a very exciting game. But until the Pelicans. <laughs>
Georgie.